going back to right now with me, Bad Goblicon. All right, Necro Goblicon, who's our next guest? You know what? Give her a hand because it is, in fact, Beth Stelling. Wow, Beth! Man, hi! Hi, it's so good to see you. Thank you for having yes. me. I mean, feel free to put your purse down. Oh, but yes. Don't worry, I they sure. should not be trusted. <laughs> I felt that yeah. way. Did you bring me something? Yeah, I did bring you my album. Oh my yeah. God, I'm so, I'm so happy. I just want to say, right off the bat, I'm such a fan. <laughs> I mean, uh, 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 dear Shuka, more like I just do Oh you. my God. Oh, that's from this, right? No, that's from 12, 12 years ago, maybe. That's what Jerry sent me. I think that was a 20, maybe nine years ago. Oh my God, Jerry. <laughs> <laughs> so, girl, daddy. That's right. What's this on? That is on HBO Max. You could forget this compact disc and just put it we'll on, put it, put we'll on put it, HBO Max. We'll put it behind my book. I got a question about HBO Max. Okay. I've been locked out, okay? <laughs> I tried too many times. Like, I couldn't remember what my password was. I've been trying to watch that show that everyone's talking about. I know I'm late to the game, but it's like, you know, it's like, Everyone's trying to kill everybody, and it's about the hierarchy. They're like, "Winter's coming," you know what I mean? Uh, what's, it, what's it called? The uh, uh, it's like Game of Thrones. Fargo. Okay, that's okay, what it is. Okay. Fargo. Would you like an April bed? I don't want. This is a Jenga scenario here. I don't want to pull the wrong one. Have them all come tumbling. That kind of sounds fun. <laughs> okay. Let's be bad, Beth. Let's be bad. You know what I mean? All right. Oh my oh, God! Wow. Okay, we've lost. Just want to let you know, I sent an email to I a friend. I thought a quick, a quick move would be best move, but um, I'll take. There, there are kind of, of room yeah, temp take, in here. Take care of it, Jerry. Take care of it. And hey, Jerry, you look average. That was really sweet. Good luck, John. Yeah. All right. Well. I'm gonna take my little average ass over here, okay? Yo, please, please, please do. <laughs> Thanks. Please do. Okay, so Beth, girl daddy, where'd that name come from? You know, it came from the fact that people ask a lot if I'm a female comic, and I have, I have a lot of um, nieces and nephews. Sometimes you can call them nibblings. One of my nibblings, Reed, calls um, my sister, his mother, okay. girl dad. She runs things, you know? Yeah. And so that is really where it stemmed from hmm. because, yeah, people have called me a f female comic so many times. I said, if I have kids, I'm just gonna make them call me girl dad. Okay, so Beth, I don't wanna have to ask you this question because you're a female comedian. I'm sure everybody's asking you, but I just have to know as a goblin. I am on my period. Okay, well, here's a question I'm sure you also get all the time. Are men funny? Often they're not. Male art is not good. Yeah, I was gonna say, because every woman I know, smart, funny, witty, and then like a guy's like, oh, my balls. And you're like, <laughs> is that, is that punchline? Is that, is that all you got, you know? And here's the thing, it doesn't, it, people are always worried I'm sensitive about it or something, about like. Oh, because. I am a female comic, it's fine to call me that. It's yeah, just. I'm a goblin host. You right, know what I mean? It's exactly. Like, how many times are people like, John, you're a goblin host. I'm like, right. can I just be a host? <laughs> exactly, you sometimes just you just want to be, be a, a comedian. Host. Yes, a host. yes. So, <laughs> You're on a new show. We just got a season Rutherford two. Rutherford Falls. Rutherford Falls. And it's on? Peacock. So who do you play on the show? I, on Rutherford Falls, I play Miss Fish. I'm a teacher. I'm thirsty for Ed Helms' character. I'm a real uh, minx. Oh. Yeah. Do you eat fish? Like I, uh, do I, eat I know fish? you like chilies from your book, but I was like, I thought I assumed you ate like minnows and like swamp birds. No offense. Beth, I'm, I'm so sorry. We just talked about getting out of the box together. Okay, I know. And you're putting so me back in the box. I'm so sorry. Beth, honestly, I'm, can you forgive me? Judge back in his box. I know. Let me out of my box. And I want to say I'm sorry for what I just said about the minnows and the swamp birds. I accept your apology. I know Beth. you like chilies. I love chilies. Beth, I read that they call you Sweet Beth. It's true. Why did they call you Sweet Beth? Well, it was kind of an old thing. I think maybe I've grown out of it. Maybe the world's beating me down a bit. So you're not Sweet Beth anymore. I don't think so, not Now anymore. you're Salty Beth. Yeah. Yeah. Is that the name of your next special? Or that or Crystal Beth. Crystal Beth, I like that. You know or, who love that? Or Florida. Beth Metal. Is that not your favorite? 
Okay. Okie dokie, Ben. We're really vibing now. Did you just throw away all the rest really of the cards? We're really vibing. We don't need them, Ben. It doesn't matter, Ben. Oh, my ben. God. Ben. Best metal. That's so good. That is so good, Ben. Okay. Oh, my God. Ben. Oh. Ben. 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 Is this thing on? Yeah. Hello. Uh, Prop comedy. She's way better than Blake. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, that's a toothpick. You gotta be careful. Okay, okay. Be careful. Here. I'll eat this later. <laughs> okay, so, so what brought you to L.A.? Did you always want to do comedy? I don't know. I'm, you, they usually say if you're a comedian, you've experienced some sort of death or mental illness in your family. I guess I must be a comedian. <laughs> yeah. um, Very tragic, my life. Yeah. Yeah. Was it pretty bad or? It was not great. I mean, I'll tell you this, being a goblin in the US, not exactly all it's cracked up to be, you know what I mean? <laughs> I know, I think probably a lot of people are jealous of you, but they don't know what comes with it. A lot of people look at you hosting your own show and getting to tour and, you know, having a book and get jealous. There's trials and tribulations, I think, with being a goblin, right? That we wouldn't know about. I feel so seen right now. <laughs> it's like I could feel the green just coming off me. That was really nice. If you don't make it in comedy, you should become my best friend. <laughs> I would love that, actually. Yeah? Right now! Okay, here, look, I brought you this too. Okay. Just gently put that on there. You're really good at being still. I think I just had a stroke. Gary! <laughs> oh my God. Hey man, your network is expanding. It's getting bigger. I feel like this season in particular was like a new me. You know what I mean? Like I, I found a way to reinvent something that everyone already loved. What's next? What is next, Jerry? Hey, that's like it. Oh, we were supposed to be out of here three hours ago, man. Yeah.